now this is what I'm dealing with. See my water bill, wonder why it was high. Now I had to go figure it out. Now this is one of the things I have to deal with. So I gotta do that. Then I gotta do a diet test, so I gotta go get some food color. That's what you do if you don't have no diet tablets. Get food coloring, put it in your bowl, and if it leaks into your, your uh, well, if it's into your bowl area, it's a bad thing. Means you gotta lick around your toilet. But if it's not, then you need to call your water company and say what's going on. But this could be the reason why my water bill is so high. I don't know. But this is about to get changed. So what happens is these copper pipes, after so many years, they go bad. So now I'm up under my house. Well, not completely well. Up under, I'm up under my deck area. So that little space I had to get in right there. It's kind of hard for a big man to do, but you know it is what it is. It is what it is, but I gotta make it happen. Some things I can do myself. Sometimes I gotta get it uh, outsourced, as we like to say. We'll see the results later. So, guys, remember how it was before when it was leaking, right? So now it's one shark bite. That is a two inch piece of hexi pipe. That's another shark bite. Then I connected it to the piece of copper. It was connected to the hose. I mean to the spout now. I'm gonna have to hook that up once I come out from under here up to the deck. But that's just, just what it looks like. As a homeowner, sometimes you, you know, sometimes you just wanna fix your own stuff, man, right? So that's, that's what I do, save a little money. Because I mean, it's nothing, you know, the beautiful thing about these shark bites, man, is they can go. And these will last for a long time. Quick fix. <laughs> Some people say a plumber's worst nightmare. Depends on who you ask.